only radio station in Hayward, California, KCRH 89.9 FM, Chabot College Radio. KCRH 89.9, these bays, best variety. That's what's up, bro. Yeah. That thing slap, bro. Yeah. This is good. The remix I play, Future Clyde Carson. My name is Young Bird, man. I've been here doing this thing. Man. Bruh. So let me ask you a question. Let me ask you, let me ask you a real question now. Is there a video coming to this soon? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The video is already in the process. We're oh. shooting the video in like three weeks in L.A. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be shot by the same person that shot my first one, Terrence Banks. That's T-Bank, the creator, if y'all don't know. Okay. And, uh... And the shooter, the shooter TPK, you know, they're part of the movement, so they're going to be shooting a video. So be on the lookout for that hot new remix video coming soon. A lot yeah. of people have been saying it needs to be X-rated, but I'm a businessman, so it's huh. not going to oh, be yeah. X-rated. So you know what I'm saying? It's about, you know what I'm saying, keeping yourself together, self center for my kids and the kids that's out there. So you know what I'm saying? It's just going to be a nice up-to-par video for those that, you know what I'm saying, that need to see it. You know what I'm saying? That's it. Okay, okay, okay. So now you've been doing music for eight years. So what are some of the things that you've had to deal with, you know, throughout the, you know, through coming up within the music Man. industry and working hard, you know? You know, sometimes you come through different situations where there's, there's issues and stuff like that. Like, Man. what are some of the things that you have to, you know, overcome in order to create yourself into the artist you are now and moving forward with stuff like that? Well, you know what I'm saying? Me as an artist, it was, it's kind of new to me being a solo artist because I've been a solo artist for about like three, four years now. You know what I'm saying? I, like I told you, I was in the group. So uh -huh. when you're in the group, you got all different type of ideas coming from more than one person. You know what yeah. I'm saying? And it just build one big monster. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, and yeah. just like now as a solo artist, it's just like it's me as that one big monster. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? So it's just now I got to overcome all the different obstacles to just keep riding extravagant verses and yeah. hooks, you know what I'm saying, that's gonna reach to the top to where I know that it's mainstream corporate, you know what I'm yeah, saying, America yeah. ties, you know what I'm yeah. saying, instead of just making it independent, low scream, you know what I'm saying, I, I'm trying to reach there, you know what I'm saying, I got a lot of people I need to help and take care of, so is myself, you know what I'm saying, so yeah, well, I got high goals in life, and I'm, 20%. you know what I'm saying, I'm just that, <laughs> <laughs> I, I was just blessed, you know what I'm saying, with the opportunities that, you know what I'm saying, that has been given and, and has came through my way of my life, you know what I'm saying, and yeah. opportunities are slim, you know, these days, so pre especially where we come from, you know what I'm saying, Man. in the Bay Area, you know, it's, it's more negativity than positivity, so, you know. Sure. I'm just trying to make it and overcome through all those bad obstacles, man. Hell yeah, hell yeah. So, so who are some of the artists that you've worked with, you know, recently? Like, you know, Clyde, you, I know you work with Clyde Carson, but who are some right. of the other artists that you've worked with, and who are some of the people that you want to work with in the future? Uh, the past, I didn't work with and produce for. I didn't produce for Filthy Rich. I didn't produce some for Stylin', Lil Blood, Shady Nate, uh, Lil Goofy. Uh, I did some back in the day with Fab. I did some back in the day with Keek. I done did, um, man. I so you've been just, doing this for a minute on, yeah, on, on, can, on, a, on a good scale. Yeah, I can, I can just, you know, I was more of a producer at first after I kind of, you know, sc scrolled off of my group. So, yeah. you know, I just was getting my name out there on a the production. And I had sat back and I thought to myself, like, man, I'm an artist and I'm great. You know what I'm saying? I make good music. So I'm like. I'm just going to push it to the extreme, and I'm going to come out with a solo project. I came out with my first solo mixtape. It was in 2009, 2010, called Slap on Deck Volume 1. Yeah. It did good, you know what I'm saying? I, I gave out all 1,500 copies, you know what I'm saying? No sale. I don't just want none out of there. You know what I'm saying? Just so people can hear my name, a lot to the friends and family and people that I don't know. And it's just reaching to where it made me feel like I can reach to the occasion to be the greatest, you know what I'm saying? And that's how I look at it. Big vision bring big things. Small vision bring small things, you exactly. know what I'm saying? So. My vision is just to stand out there and to do what I got to do, you know. It's just out here, it's a lot of crabs in the bucket, and it's hard to get out of that shell. So what I do is I just try to stay to myself and make my own moves and make my own lane so I ain't got to be worrying about a lot of the problems, you know what I'm saying? Definitely, definitely. One of us said, so who are some of the people that you want to work with in the near future? Man, I, I, I hope to work with, you know what I'm saying, Cash Money, Young Money, Maybach, huh. you know what I'm saying, anybody that's going to give me an opportunity, Interscope, you know what I'm saying, uh, Jay-Z, then Rockefeller, uh, anybody that's going to, you know what I'm saying, give me something to where I know I can appreciate life with in the music industry to where I don't have to worry about like Ross say rich forever. You know yeah, what I'm saying? And that's that's I that's my you. dream and my goal, man. I'm not in it to be just a, a local fame bearer artist. Nah, I'm in it to really be somebody that's a, a role model for the bay as World like wide, you know baby. how like how E forty them is for us. But you know what I'm saying, on a scale to where they look at a new artist like as one of those dudes. You know what I'm saying? We need future future legends. You know what I'm saying? They yeah, are legends definitely, already. So definitely. We need future le legends as myself and other past artists that's from the Bay and everywhere else that's in the, the outskirts of the Bay. You know what I'm saying? So 
Hell yeah. I'm just trying to stick it out there, man. Do what I got to do, man. Yeah, man. We finna jump right back into your track again, bro. Woo! We finna do it again, bro. So yeah. nice yeah. had to play it twice. Nice. Yeah, you feel me? We, we, yeah. might, we might even play it three times as well. You feel me? So, I just, I just, I just, I just. Yeah. <laughs> I just want to do it the right way this time. So this track by the homie Young Bird. Hey, Young Clyde Bird, Carson. Clyde Carson. Produced oh, by the mechanics. Yeah. We finna, we finna drop the feature presentation and everything, man. The phone mm-hmm. lines is going crazy. We finna check these phone lines. Phone Rex, on, I man. see you, baby. Y'all keep it locked. KCRH 89.9. And now, Young Bird and Clyde Carson.